The Inspector General of Police Usman Akali Baba has queried the suspended commander of the IGP Intelligence Response Team, Abakiari, following an investigation into alleged infractions committed by the, by the disgraced police officer. Kiari had been accused of the U.S. Federal Bureau of Investigation, FBI, of involvement in the fraudulent activities of suspected froster Ramon Abbas, a.k.a. Hush Poppy. He was indicted by a U.S. court as a conspirator in a $1.1 million fraudulent deal against a Qatari business person by Hush Poppy. In his confession, Hush Poppy also revealed he had a close relationship with Kiari. The query was issued by the IGP based on the findings by the Special Investigation Panel SIP, which investigated the alleged indictments of Kayari by FBI. It was also learned that the Office of the Attorney General of the Federation was also looking into the request of the FBI to have Kayari extradited to the U.S. for trial. The Police Service Commission had suspended Kayari from office as a Deputy Commissioner of Police and head of the IRT based on the recommendation of the IGP. It was learned that the DIG Joseph Igbunike led panel, which submitted its reports on in August, established that there were infractions on the part of Kayari in his communications with Hush Poppy. The IGP has issued a query to Abba Kayari based on the findings of the panel. The panel discovered that there were there was communication between Kayari and Hush Poppy, as well as infractions on the part of the cop, which is against the procedure of engagement of police, a security source told Daily Trust on Sunday. But the source said the panel didn't recommend the extradition of Kayari as it could be, not be established that the police officer committed any crime in the U.S., but he committed here in Nigeria. There were some infractions which is not a practice of the Nigerian police force. Kaim. There is no proof that he committed any crime on the soil of the U.S. to warrant its extradition. <laughs> it will be sanctioned by the appropriate authorities here. However, it is for the AGF to advise if, the, if there is a ground to extradite him to the U.S. They want to play politics, which is very unlikely, the source added. <laughs> they said that they would want to try to do what to punish him here but he did not commit the crime uh, in the u.s did he commit the crime in the u.s okay spokesman for the police force frank mba in a telephone interview disclosed that in line with the procedure of the police the igp has forwarded the recommendations of the panel to the police service commission for appropriate action the committee submitted its reports and the igp has forwarded their findings so the appropriate authorities which have oversight function on the police, specifically the PSC, which I believe is currently reviewing it, he said. Meanwhile, Dr. Uma Gwandu, the media aide to the AGF and Minister of Justice, Abubakar Malami, a senior advocate of Nigeria, hmm, SAN, said the office of the AGF would do the needful on the matter in line with the provision of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and that of the extant laws, the AGF will do the needful, he said. However, the senior police officer said it was only the PSC that could sanction Kayaris as stipulated by law, which ranges from suspension to demotion or outright dismissal. So the issue of a... Uh, extraditing him he's not going to come to place see the way they are following it they are following it tell us how you did with uh, what you did with nam Kano. how you were able to extradite him she they extradited because they are not maybe they are not even i don't think they are even saying extradition because as it is now the man was kidnapped he was kidnapped i don't know why now they cannot give us details now you are giving us details of how the whole thing ought to be the way things should be you are giving us details but nobody Got to know the details of how Namde Kano got here. The only thing you are telling us is that uh, it was a collaboration or the help of uh, other countries that helped you. How did you do it? We want to see the details. They cannot do that. One son is saying that uh, it is a, a, a daylight a, a robbery. It is out of terrorism that they brought this man here. <laughs> oh my God. Hmm. You see, they will not begin to quote law. They have already said it. It's only Buari that has this, you know. 
that will that will be able to um uh, how will I put it? It is only Buari that will talk the fate of a Habakiari. If Buari say no, Malam Allah Malami has said that oh it is the court. See the kind of games they are playing. But from all indications, everything, most of the things that the FBI said, they are true. They don't want to just come at they know that there are some things which is not supposed to that the man ought not to have done. And it was making my peer, 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 peer. The fear of America is the beginning of a better Nigeria. Really, it's very unfortunate, and this will save, serve as a lesson to gallant officers to stay away from criminal at all. Okay, you see now all of them say, forget it, eh, it's a lie. Eh, this man is lying against him. Fulani know how to protect their own, kill other people's own. They must free our leader, Mazinam de Kano, and over Abakiari to FBI. Finally, friendship with the big boys has ended this reputation the reputation officer of a police officer may god help him out of this mess hmm. nigeria and our justice system is full of fraud and injustice one side justice system for every successful man there is always criminal elements hiding under also query him for suing this kind of plot for a ghost president this photo president okay uh, this might contribute to high inflation, release him to the Americans. This, the disgraced police officer from the grace to grass, every celebrated Nigeria police personnel, and other security agencies like his caliber as a skeleton in their cupboards with the present messy state of insecurity and high profile criminal activities in the country. Now the Kano is real prophet of our land. He said Kiari will leave Imo in shame. And it came to pass. Hmm. He needed. He needs to be disciplined according to the rules and regulations guiding the profession. This will serve as a deterrent to others. They are just dragging the case at a snail's pace. With time, everyone will forget about it. This government's corruption fight is against. Is as useless as anything. Hmm. USA is not Nigeria. We are watching. I wonder what FBI is still waiting for. It is if it is problem of logistics like they normally lie, let them trek from here to USA to know the consequences on your she. Delay tactics, hand him over to FBI. They would never they will never do that. Even if he's found guilty, they said they are going to do it according to police say whatever, that the offense was not committed in the soil of America or in America soil. Points of correction, Abakari is not a disgraced officer, even from your myopic perspective, Abakari is a respectable officer who was done a lot, who has done a lot to his country in fighting hardened criminals. <laughs> but I'm sure you listen to the reports of the police. Why querying him? When is he coming to America to come and take photo with the Cubana fans? Hmm. 